hello my beautiful people and welcome back to my channel it is Ro Nicole here and thank you so much for clicking on this video so today's video was supposed to be a power hour but it's more like a power hour and a half I hope you enjoy it nonetheless if you haven't already done so go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below also turn on those notification bells so you can get notified every time I upload a video if you've already joined the fam, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Thank you so much for sticking with your girl. So let's hop straight into this video. This was recorded the night before the 4th of July. I want to go ahead and clean up the bottom half of the house because I knew we were going to be gone the majority of the day on July 4th and I had to go back to work on Friday. So I decided to start with the dining room, wiping down the table, cleaning off all of my DIY supplies. So I'm cleaning the table with the Method Daily Wood Cleaner. I was using the Dollar Tree Wood Cleaner, but it was leaving a waxy film on my table. So I decided to stop using it and go back to using my Method Cleaner. Y'all yeah, have seen this dust mop a million times. You know I absolutely love it. So of course there's nothing like a little twerk music to help the cleaning go a little faster. I think I was listening to Drake, Nice For What. I love that song. I'm spraying the counters down with my DIY vinegar cleaner, which is two parts vinegar, one part water, and maybe a tablespoon of Done. My countertops are laminate, by the way. I would not spray this on a stone like granite or marble because I'm pretty sure the vinegar will eat away at the finish. I think I may have rinsed out that towel at least 50 times during this video.
perfect. If you have light furniture, especially with children, Scotch Guard is definitely your friend. It makes cleaning stains so, so easy off of light fabrics.
so I did all of that sweeping. Then I realized that Christian had broken my dustpan. So I tried to get it up the old school way, you know, use an old envelope. But no, that was not working. So I had to go upstairs and grab my Dyson. This door and wall behind the garbage can was so gross from stuff splashing on it, I had to clean it. So instead of scrubbing those sticky dark spots, I spray them with my DIY vinegar cleaner first, let it sit for a few seconds, and then mop it and it makes mopping a breeze. You don't even have to scrub or anything.
the living room. Christian had fallen asleep on the couch, so I kind of straightened up the couch around him. I did change out the water before I started mopping the hardwood and I am mopping in the same direction that the flooring is laying and that just helps to reduce streaking and water marks. And this is the final result. I will definitely be doing more power hours. I feel like I got so much done in this one and a half hours and I was super motivated. Thank you so much for watching you guys and I will see you in the next one.